Welcome Year 5 parents and pupils to the presentation. My name is Stuart Ingram and I'm the Executive Principal at Avonbourne Academies. I'm also the Executive Principal at Glenmore and Winton Academies, which are also based in Bournemouth. As you know, we are two schools, um, but we are being co-located. And what that effectively means is we get the best of both. So they are single sex lessons taught in a mixed sex environment. So pupils will um, work with each other at break and lunch times and for different clubs but ultimately they get taught uh, in a single sex environment. We would really encourage you to visit the academies. Uh, the academies will be open for regular open mornings. We would really encourage you to come and see the schools in action and also speak to our current pupils about their experiences so far. So we really look forward to welcoming you soon. And also we hope you, I hope you enjoy the rest of the presentation. Hello and welcome. I'm Mrs Dyer and I am proud to be Head of School for both Avonbourne Boys and Avonbourne Girls Academies. At Avonbourne, we believe that children have limitless potential and our mission is to support students in the pursuit of this from the moment they arrive to the day they leave the academies and beyond. To support this, we offer the following. Disruption-free learning based on clear structures and routines that allow students to maximise every minute high expectations and academic rigour that is balanced with warmth and support, excellence in teaching and learning that implements our knowledge-rich, inclusive and diverse curriculum, an extensive extracurricular offer that promotes having a can-do attitude, makes students willing to take risks and be ambitious, and a focused end goal, knowing they're supported by staff, by their parents, by their peers and the wider community to be Avonborn proud. For students, we have the Avonborn way. This is a clear and consistent set of expectations that allows us to bring out the best in everyone. For students, we ask that they just try their hardest. We ask them to take responsibility for their own behaviour and always do what they're asked the first time. We ask them to be in the right place at the right time, doing the right thing, taking pride in their work, taking responsibility for their learning and the learning of others respecting other people, their opinions and their space, and having the correct equipment, looking smart and being prepared to learn every day of every week. We hope to see you at our open evenings and we hope to see you in the future at Avonbourne. Thank you. Hello, my name's James Goldsmith. I am an assistant principal here at Avonbourne Academies and my role involves me overseeing behaviour, standards and rewards. Now, there really can be no greater responsibility than being entrusted by you as parents with the, the shaping and educating of your sons and daughters. And this is a responsibility we take, rightly so, very seriously. We make no apologies for it, but we have sky high expectations for all of our students. We expect them all to achieve their personal best. We are unapologetically ambitious for all of our young people. We believe that everyone deserves disruption free learning because we understand the impact that low level disruption has on the life chances, the progress and the attainment of our students. And for these reasons, we have high expectations for uniform, equipment, behaviour, um, the, the standards and amount of work we expect to be completed within class. We expect our students and staff to make, maximise every minute, to make the most of every minute within the classroom. For these reasons, we, we have very clear and structured behaviour systems. Um, and these are supported by not only by our excellent staff, but also by, by, the, by the leadership team here. We're very lucky that being part of, a, of the largest multi-academy trust within the country means that we do attract the best teaching staff, whether that be experienced teachers coming in from other educational settings or recruiting the best new graduates from the best universities. So I really do believe the product we offer at the moment is very, very strong. I would really encourage you also to come and see us in action. We have an open door policy and we would welcome the opportunity to tour you around the school and see what it's like, what, what a normal day is, is like within the academies. And I'm sure like myself, you'll be suitably impressed when you walk around and see the quality of our young people and the quality of the educational offer um, that they're receiving. 
Now, academic success is obviously very important and exam passes are an important aspect of that. But here at Avonbourne Academies, we believe there's much more to a good education. We believe that character is often built outside the classroom, whether that be on the sports field, in a studio performance space, delivering a, a dance or a recital or out in the community volunteering. For these reasons, we've made an extensive uh, investment in sporting, artistic and creative fields. We have outstanding facilities here, whether it be the dance studios, the sports halls, the climbing walls, the performance spaces. It really is an excellent environment for students to develop those interests and, uh, and, and lifelong uh, positive habits. We really do want our students to have the opportunity to experience at whatever level they want to progress to, that, that opportunity to compete, to perform and to lead. And we also offer them numerous residential and cultural experiences, whether that be history battlefield trips, um, ski trips, overseas water sports trips. And, and these are the things that we really do think have a, have a really big impact on our students' school experience and their outlook on life. We're also really passionate about rewards and reinforcing positive behaviours. We encourage and constantly reinforce our students embodying our Avonborn way and our REACH values. And this is something you as parents will get constant feedback through the parent app, uh, whether it be you know notifications on your phone, postcards sent home, praise phone calls. We, we're really, really keen to catch students in because everybody really likes to receive praise. Hello Year 5 parents and students. Thank you so much for those of you who have come to our open mornings this term. It's been lovely to meet you as you've come in. My name's Nikki Barr and I'm in charge of Transition and Year 7 at the Avonbourne Academies. Now Transition can be an incredibly daunting experience for students and for parents as well. So we have lots of things in place to ensure that your son and daughter can hit the ground running when they join with us in September. Now, throughout the next academic year, we're going to have open mornings every week. So please do look onto, uh, on our website for further information about how you can book onto those in September. We're also going to have an open day and evening in September, which there'll be further information about further on in this presentation. Once we know the students who are going to be joining us at the Avonborn Academies, we begin planning primary school visits, where myself or a colleague goes into the primary school in the student setting so we can introduce ourselves, talk to them about all things Avonborn and answer any questions they might have. We also then meet with the primary staff to ensure all relevant information, pastoral and academic, is passed over to us so that we are fully prepared for your son or daughter when they join us. We have a transition day where the students don't go to their primary school for the day in July, but they instead come up to us and spend a taster day with us, getting to know the other students in their tutor groups and also sampling some of the lessons that we have here at Avonbourne. We also then have additional visits for students who might need a little bit of an extra transition. We have a pen pal system which we started this year which has been a huge success for those students who are coming up to us on their own from a primary school or with a few other students and therefore don't know many people. It gives them an opportunity to write to other students who are coming up to Avonbourne and hopefully arrange dates over the summer where they can meet up so they know someone on their first day. Unfortunately we've not been able to run a disco this year but we fully plan next summer to be able to run a year six disco so that we can have all the students together and they can introduce themselves and meet other students who are going to be in the class of 2029. We also have a summer school which we hope will be running next summer as well. So your sons and daughters are going to be in what we call the class of 2029 as that is the year they will graduate from us from our United Sixth Form with hopefully a fantastic set of A-level results to go off to university to study for the career of their dreams. Now, as mentioned, at the Avonborn Academies, we think it's really important that you come in and see us in action. So we have two open days planned for September. For the Avonborn Girls Academy, it's Monday the 27th of September, and for Avonborn Boys Academy, it's Tuesday the 28th of September. Further details will be posted on our websites in September when we return in the autumn term. We're just waiting to see what restrictions are going to look like at that time in order to see whether we need to have a booking system or whether we'll just be able to allow parents to turn up during the day. So please do check our websites in the autumn term for further information. On those evenings, there will be a presentation from the senior leadership team as well, including the principal. These are from six to seven. And again, further details will be posted on the website in September once we return from the summer holiday and we know what the restrictions are going to look like. Now, choosing a secondary school for your son, daughter or students, choosing one for yourself for the next few years is a really, really big task. 
And I really recommend that you familiarise yourself with our websites, which has all of our policies and the way we do things here at the Avonbourne Academies. And do follow us on different social media channels to get a feel for what it's like to be an Avonbourne student. Like I say, there'll be further information posted on the websites about our open day events and our open mornings, which will run throughout the year in September for the Ready for the Autumn term. We are very proud to be members of staff here at the Avonbourne Academies, and we can't wait to show you around our academies when they're in action very, very soon. Do keep an eye on the website for further details, and don't forget, deadline for applications for secondary school places is the 31st of October, or Halloween, so a nice easy one to remember. Have a wonderful summer break, and we look forward to meeting you very, very soon.